What is C drama? Do you watch C drama? Do you know what C drama is? I know. I've been watching C drama since like 2018, and I have watched quite a lot. Most of the people got influenced by K-pop and now watch K dramas. But I, on the other hand, watch C dramas because this was introduced to me by my best friend, and that was the starting point of our friendship. And that's why I value C drama a lot. Since I watched Chinese drama since 2018, I have come across many amazing dramas. So in this video, I have brought you 12 of them, which you would love if you are looking for a drama to watch. So let's get on to the video. Master Devil Don't Kiss Me this drama is about a girl whose mother died and before she died, she requested her friend to take care of her daughter. The woman is very rich and her son is the main male lead of the story. He is popularly known as Master Devil in his school and soon the female lead gets her admission down into that school and they both hate each other, they fight all the time and he is always on to making her life miserable. As this was my first day drama and it was introduced to me by my best friend. That was also the starting of our best friendship. So I really value this drama a lot. But apart from that, this drama is really cute and funny and can get emotional at times. And I absolutely love how its mother always ships them so much. My Little Princess. The drama starts with the female lead telling out a story about how a princess was cursed by a witch and now whoever she liked wouldn't like her back at all. And it seems that the same thing had happened to her. Let me tell you how the main leads met each other. So they met at the birthday party of her fiancé who is the second main lead and she mistakes the main lead as her fiancé but soon she realizes it's not him and creates a scene about it. Her fiancé recalls his past about something that has happened because of her and he refuses to marry her. And about the main male lead, even though she realizes that it's not the man she was looking for, she keeps running into him all the time. It was really cute. It seemed that the female lead had a princess syndrome and she thought she owned the world, she can get anything in the world and everything belongs to her. But she got out of that phrase when she realized that she was in love with someone who liked her back. I realized that there are no spoilers in Chinese dramas, so whatever I say is not a spoiler at all. And the spoiler might be some moments they share. And I'm not including those here, so you can watch it without any hesitation. Put your head on my shoulder. As graduation approaches, the female lead, Situmo, searches for a job and one day on her way to her interview, she crashes with the male lead and they both fell down their back switches. Romantic, I know, but because of that, she couldn't get a job and he couldn't sit for an important exam. Watch more to know more. This drama is the cutest of all. Most of the people have gotten to see drama because of this drama. Imagine how amazing this is. This is super cute, romantic and sweet. The good thing is that they weren't love rivals at the beginning of the story nor at the end unlike all the other dramas I have watched. And this drama is so cute. Oh my god. They live together. They do stuff together. They are so cute. Your Highness Class Wonder. This drama is about a super intelligent girl who claimed that she couldn't get into her desirable college because of a car accident with the male lead. So she gets into a badly reputed college, same college as the male lead, and she decided that she would drop out very soon. But soon enough, in a few days, she gets elected as a class monitor, which delays her plan to drop out. The female lead is Sing Fei same actress as Master Devil Do Not Kiss Me and Put Your Head On My Shoulder and because she was already my favorite, I wanted to watch this drama. But I don't regret at all. This was good. But I had some issues figuring out who the main male lead was. The brightest star in the night sky. Yang Zunzun. 
the female lead who couldn't become a singer so she decided that she wanted to work somewhere related to music so she gets into a company where she works as the assistant of the most famous singer around the area who was in the same competition as her but he won and she didn't there was someone else in the competition as well the second male lead who now sang at a bar and so it was discovered that he sings better than the main male lead and as for him he was really arrogant at first he didn't care about the company he did whatever he wanted and no one knew how to control him but after the female lead becomes his assistant she realizes the pain he goes through and only she can now control him. but there was a rule in the company they couldn't date especially their assistants before watching it i honestly thought this story was somewhat related to city heart you might have seen me talk about that book in my previous videos i guess but this drama was so amazing it provided me so much inspiration and motivation for something loved it first romance many years ago the male and the female lead were in the same high school and they were really close she had the same exact hairstyle as her guy best friend and everyone thought she was a boy and and even the male lead thought she was a boy but he liked her and felt that it was wrong to like another boy years later the female lead joins the college of the male lead but he doesn't know that this girl is the same girl as the previous one because he thought that the previous one was a boy and to your surprise she doesn't know that he doesn't know that she's a girl i love this drama and i can't stop smiling every time i watch a scene i finished watching this drama in 3 days only in 3 days and that was the fastest i have ever completed a drama my little happiness the story revolves around a lawyer whose mother didn't want her to become one but she was eventually inspired by her father and a doctor who was her first case as an intern he soon finds out that she was her childhood friend who was separated from him years ago he instantly tries to win her over i must say i don't regret watching this at all after watching this drama i have grown so much more respect for the doctors because this drama shows the life of a doctor and the male lead portrays the character perfectly an operation may take more than 10 hours and they can't sit or drink water or go anywhere else in between that operation just imagine how hard working they are oh, by the way did i mention that the female lead is from put her head on my shoulder and the male lead is the second male lead from the same drama a love so beautiful chan shaoshi a cheerful girl who doesn't study much has a crush on her classmate who is also her neighbor who is intelligent who is famous who doesn't care about her at all the story shows the sweet first love they had in school and college life i don't know what more to say about this drama other than it's really cute and portrays a really good friendship my love and light and mind this story is about a 22 year old pop singer who has some misunderstandings with her bandmates so she disbands and now nothing is going according to her plan life seemed miserable and she didn't have a job she didn't know what to do and didn't have a stay so her other bandmate who also left with her suggested her to live at her old place where now his brother lived but he didn't allow her into the house but after a lot of thinking he realized that he did it wrong So he let her live in the house but under strict conditions. As the story goes on, he realizes that he might have done something in the first episode because of which she is now jobless. The male lead in the story has hypothalamia, but there was something in his memory that he couldn't remember and it was the memory, a very important memory of the female lead. The hypothalamia mentioned in this story made me feel as if the story might have a sad ending. But I'm glad it didn't. I cried and I loved it. The Meteor Garden. The story is about Jong Sun Sai who gets accepted in a well-known college where she meets F Sir, which means F4 in Chinese or Mandarin. The F4 group consists of four members who are very popular in the university. 
whoever challenges them has to play a game of bridge with them, which is, I guess, poker. And one day, our female lead gets a joker card from the male lead, who is in the F4 group. And the joker card meant that the F4 group wanted to challenge her. The second male lead was also in the F4 group and was really good friends with Sansa and was really sweet. This story is about friendship and how an ordinary girl and the son of the most powerful businesswoman falls in love. This drama took me over a month to complete and I absolutely loved it. My Unicorn World This story is about a fake skater who fails in the entrance exam of the ice sports university but she passed in the ice hockey exam. A few days later, she receives an invitation to join the boys ice hockey team and she dresses up as a boy to enter the university. When she was little, she promised her mother that she would get into that university once she grows up. So she didn't want to miss that opportunity and got into the university, where she meets the main lead who discovers her true identity but remains silent to make sure that her secret remains a secret. Later in that story, she discovers something about him that only she can kill. But she has to keep her identity a secret to remain in the university. This drama shows how the male lead and the female lead need each other. They were love rivals, of course, but I'm so happy that they weren't as toxic as the other ones, like taking revenges and all. That didn't happen. It went on smoothly. And because I watched this drama right after Meteor Garden, I felt that this story was a little short, but it had 24 episodes. Let me tell you a word or two which you will come across while watching this drama. Ti amo, which means I love you in Italian. My girlfriend is an alien. Yeah, she was actually an alien from another planet and came to Earth to collect samples for her planet. But she loses signals and gets stuck on Earth where she meets a CEO and saves him from a car crash. When she realized that the annunciator which would help her to get in contact with her planet was gone. Later, she found out that the annunciator was in his heart and she kept on saying that there's something very important to me in your heart, which he thought was love. The male lead had amnesia, but he could remember Chai Shaochi, the female lead, the next time he lost his memory, he also lost the memory of the female lead. After he fell in love with her again, he took every measure he could for his future self to remember her, even if he loses memory. I loved it. She has supernatural powers on Earth, but she was just an ordinary creature on her planet. So that's all I have for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you liked it. And if you have watched till here, congrats, I have something to tell you that I am starting shout outs from the next week so if you want to get a shout out make sure you like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already don't unsubscribe and then subscribe because that wouldn't work and then comment anything you want and i will choose one comment or maybe two to shout out in my next video for bonus you can follow me on instagram and twitter as well i hope i will come up with the second part of this video right after i watch some more dramas and if you're done with liking and subscribing and commenting, I will see you guys in my next video next week, next Saturday. Until then, peace! Fun fact, I challenge myself to watch at least one drama each month of the year. So, if this is September, I have already started watching a drama this month. And I have watched a drama this year. 